Hello and welcome. Here, we are with Buzz Aldrin, the famous astronaut, and we're here to ask him some questions. So Buzz, have you ever seen another galaxy? Well, no. Other galaxies cannot be seen without the use of a telescope. You must use a telescope, they're too far away. Hold on there for a second. Let me take you to the site where we launched the rockets. Oh really? This is like, bonus. Yes. Alright, here we go. Let's go to moon. Let's go to space. Oh, what? Really? Yeah, we can go to the moon. Let's go on this spaceship right here that's about to take off in three, oh boy. two, one. Here we go. One. There it goes. Oh, let's oh, go. Oh. We're going to space. We're at the ascension. Oh, right. It is going. It is going. Here it is. As you can see. What you've been waiting for. We're in space now. This is like the best day of my life. I I think I have seen the craziest. Is that a zombie? Alright, next question. What is the longest time a human has been in space? Well, Valerie Pol Polabach, 748 days. Wow, that is a long time. Well, when will the next space mission be? March 28th. Mission to International Space Station. This should be a very risky mission. All right. What is the furthest distance someone has been from the Earth? 250,000 miles away, believe it or not. Whoa, that is a long ways away. Yep. All right, well, how much math is used as an astronaut? And what is the highest level of math they should take? Astronauts need to take calculus and make sure they know algebra, because they might have to use it dangerous situations. Oh, well alright. How long does it take to become an astronaut? Six years of college and two years to be a pilot. You're gonna have to take at least two years of what you're gonna go into. So, say you want to work on the engines or regulate like what's going on up there. Well, you're gonna have to take two years of that. So, basically, you can just say eight years. Alright. How heavy are the training suits? The launch and entry suit, LES is what we call it, is about 40 pounds. The spacesuit outside of the su shuttle is about 300 pounds. So all together, we're looking at 340 pounds. That's pretty heavy. Okay, so what will happen if a gun goes off in space? You can shoot a gun in space, but there won't be any fire from the gunpowder. There will just be smoke following the bullet that will be going as fast as the gravity takes it. Alright. How long does it take to get approval to launch a mission? Depends on where the mission is, but around 10 years. What is the average age of, age of an astronaut? NASA says 34, but the youngest is 27. Alright. Well, Buzz, this has been a fun interview. Yes, yes it has. It always is with you. Well, I guess I better go to space now. Okay, I'll see you there. Hut to hut! Astronaut! <laughs>